Hi, this is Tanya Lux, and I'm going to show you how to AI auto paint a photo and touch it up. I'm going to go ahead and use the open image that I have here. And if I come to the auto painting categories, artificial intelligence is all at the top. I'm going to go ahead and use AI colorful dabs and I'll let Essentials auto paint the image. And while it's doing that, only takes a couple seconds. And once it's fine tuned, it'll open up the image full canvas for me. And here we go. So what I'd like to do is touch up using the soft cloner, which by default, that is what Essentials puts you in, that particular brush variant. And I'm gonna come to Maggie's eyes what I'm doing here is touching up any area that I would like to highlight part of the dog's face. So I'm going to come to her muzzle, go ahead and highlight around her mouth here, and maybe on the bottom. So now I've got the eyes and the muzzle and the nose highlighted. Next thing we're going to do is come up to the effects menu and go to tonal control and adjust colors. I'd like to eliminate a little bit of saturation and also adjust the value. Okay, so maybe make a little bit brighter, less saturation. We could play with the hue a tiny bit here. And I'll go ahead and say okay. Next, I'd like to add another AI style on top. So the best styles to paint on top of existing paint would be the charcoal drawing or colored pencil. I'm going to go with colored pencil and we'll go ahead and let essentials begin to paint. And I'm going to keep my eye on this painting so I can see in the background some strokes building in, in her face. They're starting to come in and when I'm happy with the result all I'm going to do is tap on the canvas and it will stop the painting at that point in time. So we've got a really great painting here right now but I think I can probably make it even better. So if I come up to the effects menu and I go to surface control by surface texture this will allow me to apply a canvas texture I'm going to select one and I think the amount is a little bit too much right now so I'm going to tone it back a tiny bit and you want to do this only if you're going to post the image online. You don't want to add a texture if you're going to print on canvas. I'm going to say OK. Now we've got our AI auto paintings, a texture and to finish things off let's go ahead and apply some lighting. and warm globe probably will work well. So there we have Maggie with auto painting a couple times, a little bit of touching up. We applied surface texture and we also put a nice warm glow on the canvas. I hope you enjoy this tutorial and I'd love to see what you create.